never skip these items in Escape from Tarkov. There are a ton of common items throughout Tarkov that you're probably skipping and that's costing you a ton of rubles. I'm gonna give you five items that you need to loot that's gonna maximize your overall profit. The fifth one is my personal favorite common item in the game and it might surprise you what it actually is. Number one, red handled pliers. Specifically, I'm talking about the round pliers and the elite pliers. Round pliers, you can sell directly to therapists for around 17,000 rubles, while the elite pliers vend for around 18,000 rubles. With that said, I recommend just vendoring the round pliers, but before you vendor the elite pliers, check the flea market. There are a ton of barters that require the elite pliers, which can drive the price up to around 30,000 rubles per item. Number two, energy saving lamps. I'm a big fan of the ES lamps because not only can you sell them on the flea market for around 30,000 rubles, but you can also use them to barter for grenades. I recommend not vendoring the ES lamps. Instead, collect about six plus of them and bulk list them on the flea market. Folks will always prioritize buying items in bulk, even if the items are a little bit more expensive than the ones above it. Number three, power cords. One slot items are generally more profitable than two slot items over time. With that said, power cords are a major exception for me. You can take two power cords and craft eight wires in your hideout. Each wire can sell between 10 and 15,000 rubles on the flea market. In the beginning of a wipe, wires sell for double that. Don't vendor power cords, instead collect them and always be making wires. You'll make much more money over time. Number four, injectors. There are a ton of injectors. So the simplest way to explain this is just always loot injectors. Some of these can sell for over 100,000 rubles, but most often you're gonna find morphine and adrenaline. Adrenaline vendors for 20,000 rubles and morphine vendors for 16,000 rubles. I recommend just vendoring the adrenalines, then using the morphines to craft mules in your hideout. Pro tip, adrenaline can be a sneaky good stem to use in raid. If you're curious what adrenaline does or any of the other stems do, we have a detailed guide available for all players inside our community discord. There's a link in my bio. Number five, pile of meds. This is easily one of my favorite common items to find in raid. These items have so many uses, it's actually criminal to not pick them up. Not only do you need them for just about every craft in your med station, they also have some great barter value as well. Even so, you can list them from 10 to 15,000 rubles each on the flea market, but I recommend keeping them and using them for the barters and the crafts in your hideout. That's gonna be the best use of having those items and maximize your profitability. I'll see you in raid. Love y'all.